Hey guys, Lord of Flames here, and yes, we're in the next Fury video on what if William shows up in the House of Fred. You all vote a lot in the community. We'll say there was 7 votes, but anyways, if you've all been waiting for this for quite some time, here we are. Let's get on with the video. After the explosion at Fast Bear's Fright V2, with Nightmare and the Undead defeated, Michael managed to escape but was been trapped by William Mike. They began destroying half of his body. After Michael fell into the well, William and Mike went back to Mike's house and they thought everything is over. But not yet. After Mike was killed by Michael, he brought his father back. William runs out of the house while William escapes the neighborhood and went on a hide. He's been walking around the forest for quite some time. He managed to find an abandoned cabin around the forest. It was unlocked, and he found an old, but the electricity still works in the cabin. He began to sleep in while it rains outside. But soon months later, after the nightmare attack, the neighborhood was brought back to normal and Fastbear's Fright V2 was removed into a new company building while Freddy Fastbear's Pizzeria franchise was left behind. At the other side of the neighborhood, with Jenny and Christian moved to an old house that was mostly belonged to the Catons family back in the year 1983. After demonizers, with more deaths around the town by Michael, Nightmare wants Michael to go to the Catons house and end Jenny and Christian once and for all to end the last Caton family. Michael begins to go back to the neighborhood and found the house and hides inside without being seen and the horror begins. Back in the old cabin, with William resting, he had no way nightmares of what happened to Mike and the rest of the people Michael had killed, and seeing the world had been filled with blood and death. But then a moment in his mind, William had a choice he had kept after five months. He decided to go back to the neighborhood and find Michael and stop him from killing everyone. He managed to find a shed with tools and guns. He picked up a pistol, shotgun, and a machete and began to run back to the neighborhood. 13 hours later in the Caton house with Christian being captured by Michael and Jenny tried to fight back Michael who was her father. Michael knocks her out and began to raise his axe to end her once and for all. But suddenly, a gun fires right on Michael's back. William walks out of the shadows and reloads. Christian was shocked and surprised on seeing a man named William save him and Jenny. Michael was frustrated with anger, but a little bit shocked on seeing William again. Michael runs forward at William and swings his axe, but William backs off and shoots him five times, and Michael groans in pain. Which we know he does feel pain and the body he possessed does feel pain. Jenny wakes up and saw William and Michael fighting and then an unknown wall just opened to a sewer. She gets up and untied the ropes off of Christian and they ran away. But Michael just noticed and grabbed Jenny. William was shocked on Michael holding Jenny. He doesn't want it again. Another person being killed, he cannot let that happen. He points his shotgun at Michael's right foot and fires. Michael yells and back away. Jenny say thanks to William and follows Christian to the sewer and escapes. William finds five gasoline at the right. He looks back at Michael. He falls to the ground and he can't move his right leg anymore. William grabs one gasoline and begins to pour everywhere and repeats with four more. Michael looks up and smells the gasoline and his face with fear. He tries to stand up but he knows his right leg was shot up. But he tried to get up, but then he remembers. His father can use his blood virus to give him a new body part. Michael looks at a wall filled with nightmares blood. He took them and gave him a right new leg. He laughs insanely and runs at William. He grabs William to the ground and that is filled with gasoline. Michael swings his axe at William's left arm. William yells and groans with pain, but a moment William just smirked. Michael is confused on why he just smirks at him. But then he looks at William's right arm that is holding a lighter and throws off to the ground and the ground began to burn. The stone wall closed. Michael was screaming in pain and stares back at William with rage. 
William just stands up and stop. William just say, We all know our life must end here. We all can die together. The fire grows larger and they burn to death. That's it for the Fury folks. Hope you all like it. If you all might be confused on how William found the house on where Michael is and Jenny and Christian. Because he knows something that's similar for Fred Caton went to his home back in 1983. And yeah, that'll be it for now folks. If you want more Fury to be added, if you want yours to be added for next Fury, comment down below and I'll check it and see which one it will be next. This is Lord of Flames here. I will see you guys next time. Bye folks. Have a wonderful day.